Welcome, Anthony Hudson with you. We're ready for Sunday afternoon football. Joined now by Gary Lyon. Hi, Hutto. Absolute pleasure to be here with you. Well, today it's Fremantle versus Melbourne. The Demons fans making some noise as they step onto the field. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. It's the emblem of the team we love, the team of the red and Melbourne defence has a big job today. If they can stop the opposition forwards from getting a few chances early, it goes a long way to winning this game. They run on in full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The captains make their way to the centre circle for the coin toss. The Demons winning the toss. We prepare for what shapes as an enthralling contest here today. Gorn got in a better position. Law controls this one. Packs it out of there. Good mark there. With a driving kick. Picked up now, got the hands free. Gets a quick kick away. Scoops up the ball. Runs it over the boundary line. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. Wins the ruck duel. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Movement by hand. Viney dug out the loose ball. Gives the old don't argue. Go for goal number one. Always look like a behind. Melbourne, but one. Demand assessing the options. Plays onto himself. Punches the kick. Marks now and can send it back. Brayshaw right on the edge of his range. He takes aim. That kick. Two points the difference. Demand unsure of the next move. A sore mark from Akers. Goes with the kick. A clean pickup. Spargo short by hand. Hamling throws the ball away. Oliver elects to kick. Brown takes it well. 45 metres out. Keep it on. Going for goal number one. Listen to the fans celebrate as he drives that through. No doubt about it. He's excited about that one. Brown gets the first goal of the match. Melbourne trailing the clearance numbers, but it's not a big issue for them because of their defence. Loses control of the ball. With the ball now. Blakely getting in on the act. Slams it on the boot. And the mark will be paid. Gets a hand to the ball. And likes his chances from here. Banfield puts another one through. Smiles all round. Fremantle kick there first. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal.
hammers it finds the loose ball well collected the umpire will ball it up what do you make of the game so far Gary this is a great game Hutto and we can just sit back and enjoy it fantastic tackle manages to get a hand to it opportunity for Neil Bullen scoops it up here's Wilson penetrating handball Saylor wins it back Brayshaw goes long and delivers the goal. He acknowledges the crowd. The lead is now eight. That's a really good team goal. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Won the hit out. Taken by Conker. Salem cuts it off. Goes short by hand. May missed an opportunity to mark. He takes the shot. Goal! <laughs> Celebrating hard. Fremantle close the gap to two. This is how they can score big cutter. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Guided down nicely by Brown. He just throws that ball. A long driving kick. Ends up turning this ball over. Moves it by foot. He gives chase to the footy. Chera just gets a boot to it. The loose ball scooped up. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Smith uses it by foot. Vine got up, but couldn't bring it down. The loose ball picked up. Vine dishes it off. Takes possession. Is in his possession. Slams it onto the boot. Brown missed an opportunity to mark. But now rushed off easily. Picks up the loose ball. Just put it on the boot. Well collected. Use the hands and gives away the free. Melson goes it alone. That's a monster kick. And it's a goal. Look at them celebrate that effort. Melbourne by eight points. Lock got a fist to it. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. Chose to kick it. The ball finds McDonald. Moves the ball by foot. Simply outplayed his opponent. This will certainly test him from this distance. Neil Bullen gets for home. It's a big kick, and it goes straight through. He loved that one. That's two in a row for Melbourne. Now they lead by 14. The Demons needs to do a better job and gain more clearances at the moment. They're getting beaten in the contest, and it's affecting the scoreboard. Well taken at ground level. Good body work to win the mark. Drives the kick hard. Finds a bit of room to mark. Mundy kicks it. The ball rolls over the boundary line. Ball over the boundary line. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Does well to get it out. He's got the footy in his hands. Takes off now. Melkson with a great run. He delivers with a drop point. That's two now. Finding his feet in front of goals. He celebrates hard after that. Melbourne by 20 points. Tap came from Blob. Putting his skills on display. Gets a quick kick away. 
Kolya. Going for number one. Getting pushed out of the way was Hogan. Gaz, what are your thoughts on that opening turn? Melbourne have come to play. They've got themselves in the game and need to push on now. Well, we're out of the blocks with a frantic high-scoring opening term. I wonder what lies ahead. Chera having an impact right now. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Ready to go for the second turn. Gorn aims for his man on the ground. Neil Bullen, hurried kick. Doing well to intercept that kick. Ryan channels a long kick. A chance to gather the ball. Gathers it now. Did well to get a hand in. Walters comes away with the ball. Good mark. And looks to send it back. The Demons could have been giving the opposition a chance to move the ball around freely, which is working because they're getting on top once they force a contest. Wilson gathers it now with the ball is used. Connor Jasny used the body to take that mark. Puts boot to ball. Marks in a bit of space. Got hands to it. Gathered by Spargo. Going for goal number one. Melbourne. They're happy about that one. That pushes the lead further out. Pretty happy with that one. The margin is 26. Clears the contest. Just got the hands in the back there. Got boot to ball. Hamling didn't mark it. Ryan bared a mop up. He lays off the pass. Rushes with the kick. Collects the loose ball. Kolya going for number one. Oh, what about that? That was really special. They get around him after that effort. Fremantle reduced the margin. Gorn with the hit. He gets his hands on the footy. Matera takes a strong mark. Great set of hands. Looks to move it by foot. Viney gets the loose ball. Constant pressure and rewarded. A good job keeping it in play there. Couldn't go on with it, and the ball goes out. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game is going right now. Big tackle. Handball's under pressure. Picked up by Matera. There'll be a ball up, close to goal. Thump clear. Gorn collects it. Hibbert gives it off, and now they go. Tabernard collects the loose ball. Smith wins the foot race. He gains possession. Petrarca takes the mark uncontested. Almost cut it off. Hunt can't hold on to the tackle. He has the ball. Melcher wins the foot race. Scoops it up. There'll be a ball up, close to goal. Thumps it clear. Hughes won himself a free. Kicks it out of the back 50. And the mark has been taken. Ryan goes with the kick. Conker takes the mark. He drives it. It's marked by Wilson. Hughes is it now. Simply outplayed his opponents. Melbourne haven't been in control. They've given up way too many uncontested marks and are letting the opposition set the pace. 
Alex to kick. Brace your dug it out. Wilson hacking it out of there. Receives the handball and takes off. Goes by foot. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Brown looks to convert this opportunity. 35 metres out. Can he put it through? That one will really lift him. Of course not. Congratulated by his teammates. Melbourne lead by 26. Punches are clear. Showed good control. Slick with the hands. Puts it on the boot. Hamling presents and takes the mark. Uses it by foot. Demand marks in a bit of space. Keeps the kick low. Blakely found some space and marked. Decides to kick. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Melbourne cabbed the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Does well to cut off the kick. Off hands from Hibbard. Tries to release the pressure. Walters got the hands free. Hogan marks uncontested. 50 metres out. Moving on. He drives it towards goal. The post. They want to make more of those opportunities. Coughed up by Tabernard. Considering the options on the kick in. Flying high, and he grabs the ball. Melbourne are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Walters to have the shot from outside 50. Going for goal number one. Darts it through for another. He's excited about that one. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. He did really well there and gets the reward. Melbourne have been extremely well organised at the stoppages and it sees them being able to win the ball from the clearance. Fantastic chase and tackle. Unable to create the space. Showing some really good pressure there. 50 metres out. Going for goal number three. No problems with that kick for Brown. His teammates rush over. Melbourne. Well, it's half-time, Gaz. What are your thoughts at the major break? A good first half from Melbourne. They can be well pleased with how the game is shaping. Brown leads all comers on the ground. He's on fire at the moment. It'll be interesting to see what changes these sides come out with after half-time. The third quarter has begun. Thrashes it. Fight onto the ball. He couldn't hang on. Collier puts on a big hit. Collier will be the recipient of the free. Looks to move it by foot. He takes the mark. Puts boot to ball. Takes the mark. Melbourne are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Mundy puts it on the boot. Lever spills it. He goes for broke. No problems with that kick from Hogan. Celebrating hard. Winning it was gone. Hannon gets on the end of this. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Mundy dishes it off. Finding the loose ball was Wilson. Fancy footwork, and it's a goal to Spargo. 
Gets some reward for his efforts. The lead is now 25. Punched away. The ball spells to Oliver. Finds a way through. Nice work from Hart. Got boot to ball. Melchon looks to get onto the football. Conker collects the loose ball. Brings it out of the pack. Good mark there. The kick from Chera. Contests the hard ball. May blinks up with a chance to run. Great mark. Hunt slick with the hands. He's got the footy in his hands. Knew where his teammates were. Getting in the way was Ryan. Just gets it onto the boot. He just sets the ball well. Melbourne have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Ball tossed back in. Gets the loose ball. Hands that ball to the opposition. He has the ball. Hacking it out of there. Takes that one strongly. Gets a hand to the ball. The possession caused a turnover. A bit too hard with a push. And it's a free kick. McDonald gets on the end of this. Works it across the ground. Salem dug out the loose ball. Oliver now heading off to the bench for a break. It'll be a ball up. Gorn clears the contest. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. A chance to reload the attack now. Works it across the ground. Cleanly picked up. Hogan gets the loose ball. Finds a way past. Darcy crosses off the tackle. Handballs out into space. Ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. Gets it away. Chera looking to put through another goal. Fremantle now only trailed by 24. Melbourne could have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. That's why they're still in front. Hits the target by hand, wins the race to the ball, awkwardly got the handball out. Salem slams it onto the boot. Five quickly onto the boot. Ryan is blowing hard after that effort. Quick handball. He can take off after that handball. Is in his possession. Hannon delivers with a straight drop punt. And that puts them further in front. Look at him, he really enjoyed that one. Melbourne by five goals. Gorn went it down. With the ball now. Hurried kick. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Looks up with the kick. Viney, the better man there. Sinks the slipper into it. Lever pushes a low ball. Neil Fallen found a way to mark that one. With a driving kick, McDonald hangs onto that one. Chose to kick it. Mark by Dawn. Uses it by foot. Mark will be paid. Leaving uses it by foot. Ball out of bounds on the wing. Walters coming on. Toss back into play. Gorn won the duel. Hamling down. Keeps it moving. Kicks hurriedly. Ends up turning this ball over. Chips it towards half forward. It's a foot race to get this one. Scoops up the ball. Manufactures the handball. The ball in the hands of Grayshaw. Into the post it goes. Melbourne. Go for Fremantle. But 31. Plays on from the kick in. Demand manufactures the handball. Demand just too high with the tackle. He heads for home. Melbourne supporters delighted by that effort. Rachel puts his second on the board. He's enjoying that goal. Melbourne could kick the last three goals.
37 points the difference. Taps it down. Has it now. Banfield rushes with the kick. May get them off up. The Demons can work the ball with this free kick. Closing in here on three-quarter time. Decides to go to the middle. Hannon not getting much of it, Gaz. That's right, Hutto. He just can't seem to get into the game. Five lobs the handball. Conker just gets it onto the boot. Took his eyes off the ball. Akers picks up the loose ball. Gaz, what do you think of that? Melbourne believe they can win this game. It's time to show it. Neil Bullen on top of the ranking points. He is dominating this game. One quarter of footy to go. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. One down. Doing well was Mundy. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Finding the ball was May. Applies a bump. Does well to keep it in play. Eventually the ball goes over the line. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? This game needs a spark at the moment. Hammers it. Connor Jasny brushed off easily. Ends up with Mundy. Just sneaks in from behind. Unable to capitalise on that opportunity. They'll be looking to close the gap now. Still plenty of time. Decides to play on. Gorn elects to kick. Melkson will be upset with that. Kicks out of the congestion. Hannon struggling to run at the moment. Blakely has had plenty of it, Gaz. He's been superb to him, Decides to kick. The ball goes over the boundary near the 50. Umpire calls for a throw in. Umpire tosses it in. Tap down. A chance for Viney. Clears the ball from the contest. Just releases the ball. Sends it clear of the contest. Matera leaps over the top. Chooses to play on. Takes it well. 35 metres out. Hold an opportunity here. Massive kick here. They need to convert this opportunity. Smiles all round. The Dockers trying to get back to a manageable score. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Fremantle need to be more efficient with their ball use. They've allowed the opposition too much influence from intercept marks. Wants to keep it moving. Going for goal number one. Nice mark under pressure. 20 metres from home. He might kick a goal. Sends it home. He acknowledges the crowd. They're working their way back now. Melbourne aren't making the most of their hit-outs. It's going straight to the opposition. What can you tell us, Gaz? 
I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Over the top of the pack. Love puts it on the boot. Marks that ball uncontested. Good opportunity for Fremantle to put a goal through here. Hogan will have to put everything into this one. He slams it towards goal. What a kick. And he puts it through. He's excited about that one. Fremantle have three in a row. They're gaining momentum here. Thrashes it. He gets his hands on the footy. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Punched away. Just dismisses his opponent. Just gives it away. And we'll get a ball up. Gorn thumped it clear. Hughes applying physical pressure. Fife collects it. Goes by hand to Walters. Slips the handball to Conker. Oh, it just hits the post. Fremantle has dropped more than two goals behind. Melbourne could turn the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Cox doesn't take the mark. Hamlin counters it at goal. That is a stunning goal. He celebrates hard after that. Fremantle have four on the trot. Just under two goals, the difference now. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. The Demons got leading the contested ball numbers. It's always the starting point for a coach to find how well they attack the contest. Turned it over. Links with hands. Banfield gives it to the player running past. Can't take possession. Fancy footwork, and it's a goal that's happening. Celebrating hard. Fremantle have five unanswered goals. Fremantle behind by five. Thumps it clear. Oliver might have overworked himself there. Couldn't take it. Quickly onto the boot. The ball knocked up. Pushes off the tackler. Goes with the kick. Couldn't quite with the mark. Mops up the loose ball. He's got the football now. Gets into some space to mark this. Wilson, interesting handball. Takes possession. Goal! Tackle. Didn't get away from that tackle. Great tackle. They're doing really well to chew some time off the clock here. Dug out the loose ball. Akers turns a free kick. Slams it on the boot. A race for the loose ball. At full stride, receives the handball. Smith won himself a free. Uses it across half back. Conkick slowing down now. Might be in need of a rest. Cox so close. They're just a behind. There's nothing in this. Gorn players move as they look to provide an option. Has a runner alongside him. The ball rolls across the line. Lever running off for a break. The boundary umpire will toss it back in. A critical stage of this one. Brown won the hit out. Gets around the pressure. The handball hits the target. Sweeping handball. Uses it now. Ball collected. Snaffled up by Hamlin. He decides to go for home. He just loved that one. Melbourne starting to exert some dominance now. They lead 75 to 65. The Demons score in front in the clearances and it's allowing them to create pressure up the field and scoring opportunities. Melbourne could taking advantage of their Ruckman's ability. It gives them first use at the stoppages and forcing the opposition to defend. Langdon got hands to it. We'll get a ball up. Gorn thumps it clear. 
Con kick. Looking a bit sluggish out there. Handballs to a teammate on the run. McCarthy failing to get near it, Gaz. He's barely touched the ball like that. Haven't called his name too often today. Puts it on the boot. Doesn't hold on to the mark. Fantastic result for fans of Melbourne. It's just a bit of class that sets them apart today and a bit more polish when they need it at most. That's why they walk out here with us. It's the ever blue of the team we love, the team of the red and the blue. Every heart beats true for the red and the blue and we sing this song to you. Final scores are 75 to 65. Thanks for joining us, Gaz, but that's all we have time for. Thanks, Hato. I've enjoyed every minute of it.